Hey, what is up, everybody? I am Jason, and you watch my channel, Micro Investor. So, in this video, we're going to be talking about uh, some different stocks that Kathy Woods Arc Invest is investing into. But the main one that we're going to be focusing on is how Kathy Woods has chosen to uh, purchase quite a few shares of a SPAC stock, a uh, special purpose acquisition company by Chamath Palihapitiya's Social Capital, and that is the ticker symbol IPOB, which is going to be merging with Open Door. So we got a lot to get to in this video. If you guys don't mind, please do me a huge favor and be sure to smash, destroy, and I'll hit that like button because it does help me with the YouTube algorithm and helps spread this video to more people that might find it interesting. And also subscribe if you have not already. Now let's get to this. Let's take a look over at ARK's Next Generation Internet ETF, ticker symbol ARKW. Now, this ETF is up about 140% over the last year. So ARKW is an actively managed ETF by Kathy Woods, and it usually has between 35 and 50 holdings in it. This actively managed equity strategy seeks long-term capital growth by investing in U.S. listed securities, including ADRs, of companies focused on next-generation Internet. Companies with this strategy aim to capture the substantial benefits of new products and services associated with scientific research and technology breakthroughs in Internet-based products and services. New payment methods, blockchain technology, big data, the Internet of Things, mobile, social, and streaming media. The ETF has 49 holdings in it, and I'll leave this here for a second so you guys can pause this video if you wanted to. Um, but the main holdings are Tesla, Roku, Square, and then down to the 30th uh, largest holding in here with almost 1.6 million shares is IPOB. Now at the moment, IPOB makes up 1.2% of this ETF with $33.67 million worth of IPOB invested into it. Now, Kathy Woods has been actively buying IPOB into ARKW. Uh, she's been doing it pretty consistently now. It's looking like she's very bullish on the stock, but this is just a SPAC. This is not even open door yet. So that's the interesting thing about this is that uh, she is so bullish on this and she's picking up so many shares of it right now and continuing continuously adding more and more shares to it. And Kathy Woods has also been buying IPOB in another one of the ETFs and that is ARX Fintech Innovation ETF, ticker symbol ARKF. ARKF is also actively managed by Kathy Woods, Has usually has between 35 and 55 holdings, and it focuses on companies that are innovative in financial technologies. And over the last year, ARKF is up close to 100%. Now, the largest holding in ARKF is Square, and Square has about 12% of the holding here. Um, but if you look at the eighth largest holding, it is Zillow. And if you go down, IPOB is the 44th largest holding out of 46 holdings in this ETF with uh, 185,000 shares, close to $4 million worth of it invested into it. Now, I will not be surprised if Kathy Woods does not pick up more shares of IPOB to add to ARKF. Now, if we look at IPOB stock on October 9th, IPOB closed up 13% and kept going up more in after hours. This has now brought IPOB to new heights. And just over this last month, IPOB is up about 80%. Now, I'm not sure when the merger is going to be complete with IPOB and Open Door. Now, to give you a little bit of a background on Open Door, Open Door is an online platform that lets homeowners quickly sell their houses. Open Door was founded in 2014 and it is a dominant player in the i buying space, which is a term that is used by startups that let homeowners rapidly sell their homes to the company, which they then list that house on their platform and then take a cut from both sides of the transaction. Open Door utilizes data analysis to determine its pricing, which is a central element of its business plan. If it overpays for a home upfront, it could take a loss, and if it tries to underpay, most likely a seller is going to look elsewhere. The deal values Open Door 
at an enterprise value of $4.8 billion and will generate up to $1 billion in cash proceeds. Now, Mr. Chamath Palahapatiya is going to be putting in $100 million of his own cash into the business. Now, what makes Open Door such an interesting company to go public through a SPAC is that unlike a lot of these other popular SPAC stocks that are out right now, um, like, say, DPHC or SPAQ, et cetera, uh, that are all like EV companies, none of them have any uh, revenue yet. Now, in the case of Open Door, Open Door is a company that does have revenue. And actually, in 2019, Open Door's revenue was $4.7 billion, and they sold 18,000 homes. Now, they're still running at a substantial loss, and actually this year, uh, things aren't going as well as they were in 2019. Uh, that is because in April, due to the pandemic, obviously, they had to lay off one-third of their staff. But looking at this company from where they were at in 2019, when they had the $4.7 billion in revenue, it makes sense why uh, Chimith Palihapitiya's social capital would have interest in merging with Open Door, and why uh, Kathy Woods would have interest in ARK Invest ETFs get an early head start on investing into Open Door through IPOB. Now, of course, there are some pretty big uh, companies in this space that Open Door is going to have to compete with. They have to compete with Zillow, Offerpad, Redfin, etc. But the iBuying companies only make up 0.5% of the $1.6 trillion home buy market. Now, I think IPOB is probably the most popular SPAC stock out there, and it, it makes sense. Now, in my opinion, anything that Chamath Palahapitiya social capital is involved with is really great. And you guys know that. Um, and with Kathy Woods, who I also like a lot, ARK Invest um, is involved now in investing into IPOB. That just makes the stock even more interesting than it was, in my opinion. So I'd like to hear everybody's thoughts on IPOB. Do you think that there might be a little bit too much hype behind this now? Or do you think that there is a lot more room for this to grow and it's going to be going to the moon? <laughs> Anyways, um, also, what are your thoughts of Kathy Wood's ARK Invest being bullish on IPOB and buying even more shares? And it, it's she's been consistently doing this, by the way. Uh, so I'd like to hear your thoughts of that. So as always, everybody, please like, share, comment, and subscribe. I have new videos coming out on my channel all the time. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you all in the next video coming soon.